Hi, Nicholas. This is Jim Gillis with Win My Vote and wanted to talk with you about building a group page for represent.us um, here on our site uh, and then leveraging uh, the site to organize all of your supporters uh, around specific candidates and propositions and measures that are on specific ballots. So the way that it works is that Win My Vote is a free voter engagement site. Uh, voters can sign up with just an email address or a social media account and they type their zip code in and that zip code uh, will put them in specific voting districts. And then we have some uh, links and resources for uh, the voter that has overlapping districts and that type of thing to quickly find their district. But with that, we can give them a ballot for the upcoming election. So for example, we'll use this one, the November 8th presidential ballot here in San Francisco, California. So as a voter, I can just click on this ballot right here and I can see all the candidates that are in all of the races going all the way down from the national level all the way to the state and congressional districts, state assembly, state uh, senate districts, and then into the city level and the county level and even school board races. I can also see all of the propositions as well as all of the local measures. Um, so with this, for example, here in California, if I want to learn a little bit more about Proposition 55, I can click on that. Here, a little one minute sort of explainer video. Um, but probably most important, I can see groups and organizations here that are supporting it as well as those that are opposing it. Uh, and this is where Represent Us would come into play. You guys would have a group page, and I'll show you what a group page is. Uh, so for this one, we'll just use the California Teachers Association. Um, so if I am a member of the, uh, the California Teachers Association, one, I can click here and just watch their video. It wasn't that long ago. Years of devastating cutbacks to our schools. 30,000 teachers laid off. Class sizes increased. Art and music programs cut. We can't ever go back. So vote yes on Proposition 55. Prop 55 prevents 4 billion in new... You know, and if I want, I can even click through and look at the group page. Positions that they are endorsing or opposing, you know, and I can scroll through those and see different candidates uh, as well, um, you know, on on a variety of different ba um, ballots. Um, so with that, if I were to go back to my ballot, um, and let's say if I wanted to vote in line with these guys, it would all start as undecided. Uh, I would say great, and I vote yes now, and when I go back to my ballot. You can see here that the nameplates turn green, so it's a very prominent yes. Um, and I also know that I'm in 13% of the people who are voting yes, and then there's 7% that are voting no, and there's still 80% that are undecided. So this can be two months, three months before an election. You can use this as a polling uh, mechanism where you can reach out to all of your members, say Prop 50, let's see one that's not done yet here. Well, we'll, them all. No, we'll go to a measure. Say, you know, measure RR is super important and we want you to learn all about it. You know, we have videos about it and if you agree with us, favorite us. Um, and then I can work with you guys directly as far as the number of people that are favoriting it. You'll obviously be able to see the percentage and I can give you some data on the back end as far as, uh, you know, what videos people are watching or how long they're on the site for uh, before they favorite that type of stuff. And with this, you know, this is, um, you know, people who are, are logged in filling out their ballot. They're not people who are very excited about it, um, but then, you know, go away and you can never reach them again or they get real busy. So the whole idea, you know, of win my vote is that as the election comes up, there are things like, you know, these are the important dates for this election. So we send out emails to these, to the voters saying, Hey, you have one more day to register for early voting. You have one more day to register to vote absentee, you know, whatever it may be. And as a voter, I can simply then, you know, just go down and say, okay, great. I've already done half of it. You know, I'm going to vote yes on 55, et cetera. So it's a real connection between a lot of the enthusiasm that voters experience at rallies or when they watch a video uh, or when they hear about something. You know, and then making it really, really simple for that last step follow through so that they show up and they vote. 
Um, anyway, we'd love to talk with you about it. We're, we're designing um, and building new features all the time, and, and we'd be happy to talk with you guys you know, about some of the stuff that we have in mind uh, for groups moving forward as well. Uh, thanks a lot. For